Hi everyone, it's Jamie here from FX Learning. Uh, let me just take a couple of trades on USD CAD. Is this USD CAD? Yeah, I'll pop this over here so you can actually see. Uh, and I'll take a couple more. Now, if my voice doesn't sound very well, it's because I've got a really bad sore tooth today. And I've got this kind of like, uh, when I talk, it's a bit like which is rather frustrating, as you can tell there, because I'm dosed up on painkillers, um, and it's rather annoying. Okay, I've got another setup arm, and fat, what's that, Euro USD. I'm gonna take Euro USD up quickly, quickly, quickly. Euro USD for a 10 minute expiry, and I'm gonna take Euro USD up, okay, and we'll stack them. Okay, right, um, so, <laughs> I can't actually talk. This is rather bad. Okay, so I'm going to go over a uh, some setups that one of the BD... Look at some of the results in the group this week. Just look at these results here. Beautiful. That is a lot of money made from Jordan here. I think Jordan's a, uh, a full-time member with us now. Uh, well, he must be with them sort of results. Um, this was yesterday's training Wednesday. Uh, nice results here. Um, I think all these are on binary. Let me have a look. Uh, I think these are all on binary. Yeah, so these are binary setups using uh, pretty much what uh, basically the normal BD rules, waiting for the moving average to enter the buy or sell zone and then getting into a trade there. Uh, so it was this member here. So this member spotted these setups while trading the and strategy as you can see he's highlighted them here here um another one here okay uh, another one let me just move this out of the way so you can actually see them another one here and a another one here and he goes on to say look another one here another one here uh, and he just basically goes on to say that he's been trading these setups every single day, okay, or in today's session. And uh, he has got, um, been trading them all morning. I've only had one loss. So we're gonna head over to the charts now and I'll actually show you this setup he's trading, okay? He's trading these setups here, okay? Now, this will only work with the BD 6.0, okay? It'll only work because we have the pullback modes on, okay? And you only get this with the 6.0. So the top button needs to be on and the bottom button needs to be off and then we're looking for setups like this, okay? These are price action patterns. So you can see here, prices pull down, pull back, and we popped an arrow and price shoots off like this, okay? So this was Euro USD, and then you'll notice I also took a sell on USD CAD, or was it a bar? Yeah, so again, look at the sell on USD CAD. Okay, price trends up like this. Okay, does something like this. Then we get an arrow, then we get another arrow, and then price drops. So yes, that is the theory behind this little price action strategy with the binary destroyer. As you can see, two setups right in front of you now live okay and um, both of these are going to be nice nice winners bringing me a nice profit of 225 pound to start the trading session so what i'll do everyone is i'm going to pop this like this now okay and i'm going to wait for some more setups to happen i need to put, turn all of my pullback modes on like this uh so yes like i said i do apologize if uh, you know, I'm struggling to, you're struggling to understand me. I have got a very painful mouth. So I'm gonna pop this like this now. Okay, I'll pause the video. I mean, look at, look at USD CAD. USD CAD is a nice, nice winner. Look at that, nice drop from that signal arrow there. And then it should be a nice buy from your USD as well. Again, yeah, your USD is nice and money. So what I'll do everyone is I'll pause the video and I'll be back in five minutes time. Hi everyone, so as you can see here, beautiful winnings, beautiful winnings. I actually used to trade this set, uh, I wouldn't call it strategy, but I actually used to trade these setups when we were building the binary Shure 6.0. Um, and as you can see here, every single one of those trades comes into the money. So I'm just gonna wait for these to close now, 
Uh, and I'll just show you my trading history for this week. Uh, I'll blank out my um, deposit and uh, account size. I'll just show you the actual uh, results of my trading history for this week. I think, I'm not joking you, I'm on a 100% win ratio every single day this week. I don't know what it was, but the end of August and now going into September, my trades have just literally been on fire, both binary and both on Forex as well. You know, I shared my account with you the other day. Well, my account is now, uh, well, I made basically almost five grand since I started it last uh, last Tuesday. So almost uh, just coming over a week now, which is uh, not bad whatsoever, especially for a week's wage. Um, so, uh, yeah, I'll just pop this like this. Oh, what I'll do now, as you can see, these trades are coming into the money. Uh, and I will bring up my account history and just show you. We'll do some more trading. Uh, so wait for these to come in like this, this, and this. So what I'll do is I'll pause the video and I'll be back in a couple of minutes. Okay, everyone. Right, so uh, what's today's date? Today's date is the 5th. So Monday will be the 2nd of September. Okay, so we'll go down here. Okay, and we'll find the second okay so i started my trading session on the second so i had a couple of losses on monday and then i believe i might have broke even on sun on monday um no i didn't i ended in profit okay right so basically since monday i have done one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. So I'm on thirty nil. And as you can see, the today's date is the fifth. So you can see today's trades are here okay yesterday's trading was here all the way up to here uh wednesday's trading was or tuesday's trading no wednesday's trading was up to here so yes not hiding everything as you can see all of my trading results so what i'm going to do now is i'll pause the video wait for some more setups and we'll try and see if we can do 40 nil to end this week's trading session so i'll pause the video everyone and i'll be back hi everyone so i had a signal on AUD USD. okay popped a beautiful signal price dropped uh, and i sat here for a couple of minutes thinking should i enter this trade doesn't quite meet the uh, price action pattern i'm looking for because i want this actual pattern to appear more in this zone at the top um but we've seen a nice solid engulfing candle from this zone so this is why i entered a quick five minute expiry at the close of this candle hoping that uh price does drop and in fact look you can see price is actually pulling against me so um we will see what happens with this trade what i'll do is i'll Oh, uh, what was it? AUD USD. So I'll pop this like this on this currency pair, and I'll pop this like this, uh, and I'll update you very soon on this setup. Now, like I said, this is a, uh, I would say this is an extremely risky trade. Uh, I was hoping for the price to continue to drop from this engulfing candle, maybe come down to this uh, moving average, but at the minute it's gone completely opposite against me so we'll see what happens anyway in three minutes time hi everyone uh usd jpy has just popped a signal i'm going to be taking that up uh so five minute expiry no 10 minute expiry we're going for and i'm up right okay so we have got a 10 minute expiry on USD JPY because this trade actually, funny enough, meets the rules. Uh, and AUD USD doesn't meet the rules. So 
Uh, in theory, this would be three out of three for this kind of, I wouldn't call it strategy, but price action setup. Notice how AUD, USD just typically take a trade, go straight the opposite direction. Uh, so I got that analysis wrong on that one. Um, but again, this setup doesn't meet the rules anyway. Uh, I was just being overconfident because I had 30 nil, so I knew that I could afford to lose some trades. Uh, and losing trades is what's about to happen. But USD JPY, again, this setup does meet the rules, okay? It does meet the rules, and as you can see, price is nicely going uh, in my direction. So what I'll do, everyone, well, first of all, we all know AUD USD is gonna lose, okay? So there's no point uh, playing the video on that one. Um, wait for these to just lose, basically. So I'll be losing 50, I'll be losing 200 pound on these trades, but hopefully uh, USDJPY setups recover that. I'm just gonna work it out now. Times one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, 225 pounds. So USDJPY, if these trades come in, I will be up 25 pound on the actual setup. Uh, obviously I've won a few trades before that, so. Four, three, two, one, zero. So what I'll do everyone now is I'll pause the video and I'll update you very soon on in seven minutes time on USDJPY. So I shall be back. Hi everyone. So I just want to show you that AUD trade that I took for five minute expiry, right? You know, I sat there for a couple of minutes thinking, should I take this setup? It doesn't quite meet the rules. Uh, and look what happens. That way, that trade would have won for a 10 minute expiry, which is rather frustrating. So I go and take a five minute expiry and it loses. So yes, USDJPY is dropping nicely in the money. It's, price is stalling at the minute, price is going sideways. So we've got two minutes to go on that one. Uh, so I'll be back in a couple of minutes time uh, on, in a while. I'll come back in two minutes time and I'll update you on this trade. Hi everyone, so all just updating you on USDJPY trade. As you can see, price just went sideways when I entered this trade, but luckily uh, price did pull enough for this to close in profit. Five, four, three, two, one. So winner, wait for these all to just come into the money here. Now, to be honest, I will probably call that a day. Uh, so what I'll actually do, okay, is I'll actually add up my total trade results now right, right in front of you for this week's trading. Uh, and yeah, I'll show you exactly how much I've earned from binary this week's trading. So I'll pause the video and I will be back. Hi everyone, so I just wanna update you on today's, in fact, you can't actually see the dates, okay? I don't really want to show you my account history. Uh, right, okay, so we have, I started the day, let me explain that again, because my tooth's hurting. I started this week off with a couple of losses. As you can see, I had a running streak here, uh, three losses, a uh, couple of wins here, another three losses, uh, and then I literally had a running streak all the way up to here, which you see me lose on AUD USD, and then I closed the rest of the trades nicely in profit. So yes, 1,526 pound. As you can see here, I had an awesome running streak if it wasn't for those AUD trades, which typically, it always happens. Uh, so yeah, that is my trading session done for this week. I hope you enjoyed watching my videos. Uh, have an awesome weekend and I'll catch up with you next week on some more live trading. Thank you for watching.